Hi, welcome to the Mathematics of my channel. Today we are going to solve another interesting integral. So the question is, integral from 0 to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 uh, times 5 uh, square root of 2 times sine square of x dx. Okay, now I am going to take this is equal to i n. Mm, I use substitute to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Uh, so this is equal to n because this is continuously flowing down so now we can write i is equal to 0 to now n 5 now here we know square root of 2 times sine square of x dx so square root of 2 sin square of x dx okay now here is square root of 2 is a constant so we can write outside of the integral so square root of 2 0 to n times 5 now si square root of sin square of x so we know this is equal to absolute value of sin of x okay now what can we do so 0 to n times 5 n is equal to 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 uh, so now we can write square root of 2 times n times 0 to 5 absolute value of sine of x dx okay how we can write n here okay let's go to the graph of sine of x so we know this is graph of sine of x and if we take this area is a and we know also this area is equal to a and if we take integral from 0 to 5 uh, sine of x so we know sorry uh, 0 to 2 5 we know this area get cancelled so this is equal to 0 uh, but now we need to here we need to absolute value of sine of x so we know absolute value of sine of x graph Here uh, in this area, okay. Now we know also this area. Now, if we take this is a, now this is a, now this is a, also is equal. So now here our integral 0 to n times 5. So this is repeat n times. That's why. I write n here okay now square root of 2 times n now 0 to 5 we know 0 to 5 absolute value of sine of x is equal to sine of x dx so square root of 2 times n and integral of sine of x so we know this is equal to cosine of x and the limit is 0 to 5 ok now square root of 2 times n times here if we plug in 5 so cosine of 5 oh this is wrong uh, actually integral of sine of x is equal to minus cosine of x sorry for that so now here uh, minus cosine of 5 so we know cosine of 5 minus 1 so minus times minus 1 plus 1 and minus uh, times minus cosine of 0 so 1 plus 1 okay now
now we know n is equal to 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 1 plus 1 2 so we can write 2 times 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 times square root of 2 so okay this is the answer if you like so if you want you can simplify this by using calculator okay thank you for watching